Yes, sir. We back at it. We back in them trucks, bro. We back in them trucks. YouTube's goddamn deal, man. It's one and only pal. Happy. And we are back with another video. And today, bro, I'm going back. I'm going back to my roots. I'm getting back in that truck. I'm getting back on that road. Not really, but kind of, sort of. I'm back doing Amazon Relay. I know I haven't like put that content out there in the past because I don't even think the channel was started yet. So by the time I started the channel, I was in the van. But before I had the van, I was in a box show doing Amazon Relay. You know, but shout out to my guy, Jay Jones. He's giving me an opportunity to not only make some extra coins, but possibly get back into the box truck industry, the transportation industry. You know what I'm saying? This is my second go around with this. And uh, we finna, we finna see what this gonna come out to be. Come out to be. Come to be. Whatever. But it is currently 8.24. And uh, I have to be at the truck by 2.15, 2.30. So I'm about to shower and lay it down, take this nap. So next time you see me, I'll be at the truck. So if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that like, comment, and subscribe. Follow your boy on all the socials, and I'll check y'all in a little bit, bro. All right, y'all. So we are at the storage. Right now, I got to pull up. It is 2.08 in the morning. Man, I ain't been up this early. Well, I had to get up to go grind since I was working at the post office, bro. Golly. And the thing about working like at these hours, bro, it's hard to eat, man. And shoot, right now my stomach kind of like upset with me and all that, but we still gotta get this thing going. But yeah, man, we here at the at the at the storage house, waiting on bro to pull up. And then we gonna head to the Amazon warehouse. Let me make sure I got my ID on my little badge. Uh, yep, here it is, right here. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna show y'all too much. I got got some personal info on that, but yeah. Time to get to it. Time to get to it. You know, I used to be like hesitant to like tell what I've been through, like entrepreneur, entrepreneur wise, because people always got, I always got something to say, bro. And it just like, you know what I mean? Like when I had my box truck, I just simply ran out of money. Do y'all really like chalk that up as a failure? I don't know, but to me, you know, I can say that I tried and I gave him my all. You know what I'm saying? 5,500 cash for that truck. 300 for the LLC. 400 for the uh, authority setup. That's MCA dot number. And then she, I just, I just didn't know about the the uh, the insurance. You know, insurance for them trucks. That's a different beast. You can't just put that on your regular car insurance. You got to get a. a a commercial policy and you gotta put down like two thousand and I just didn't have two thousand for that. You know what I'm saying? So uh the world shut down, I'm losing money at a storage, parking the truck at a storage, and then she I I got the opportunity to get up out of it and I did, I took it. You know what I'm saying? Then I got the van. Did that for a little bit, made my little videos and I got up out of that to be back doing it again from where I've been through with a box truck. It's kinda dope, bro. It's kinda dope. So I'm finna wait on bro, and then we gon' get in this truck, man. All right, y'all, here it is. The box truck. My new Leo, Leo. This is actually day two, because the first day I did a ride along, and I was trying to like learn the system, or remember how to how to do it, because I did it before, but I just forgot. And this ain't no 20 footer. This is this that 26 jump. It's that big jump. You know what I'm saying? It's already been running for about five, 10 minutes, so I'm ready to go. It's all warmed up. So yeah, man, that's what I'm doing now, man. That's what I'm doing. Go ahead and get up in this zone. Go ahead and get up in this zone. Oh, shoot. Oh, so trip. Bundle up. Right, so Pete. Woo. I know y'all probably thinking, Pat, what about the machines? I, I still got the machines, bro. I still got the machines. This is a uh basically like every other day thing. So I restock Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, and my machines, uh 
yeah, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and I do this Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday. So it's just the perfect schedule. And you know, on the ride line, I was talking to bro, and he would just tell me, man, if you got something new, just let me know, man. You a boss, I'm a boss. It's all about communication and respect. And I was like, yeah, yeah, I got you. You know what I'm saying? It's all about a respect thing. You know what I'm saying? I got, I got to respect his, his business and his truck, and uh, he gonna respect my schedule if something come up. So that's what it's all about, man. So I'm actually kind of early because I got to be at the thing by four. But uh, it is 2.51, yeah, so I got a little bit. So I'm gonna get there early anyways to make sure my badge work, and then we can go ahead and load up. I don't have a long route, but my first day by myself. So let me go ahead and put this camera down and uh, get to the to the warehouse and I'll tap back in. All right, so look, bro. I was supposed to show y'all the whole process, show y'all my load and where I was going and this and that. But I spent so much time at the Amazon warehouse that I was kind of behind. I mean, I still got done early, but I was I didn't have not a, I didn't have a lot of time to spare in between stops. And it's because <laughs> I am so rusty, like backing this thing up. Ain't no camera. All I got is the mirrors and shit. And so all the post office, the little the little little thing that you use to connect it to the truck, they all different. Some crooked, some straight. So. Yeah, I just gotta, I just gotta get back in my, in my bag driving this thing. But other than that, I'm whipping this motherfucker. I'm, I'm whipping it. So I'm currently getting gas right now, and then he about to head to the crib. So I'm not going to end this video right now, cause I want to show y'all the whole process. And uh, <laughs> bro, I struggled backing this thing up at the Amazon right now, cause I thought I was supposed to get it straight in the middle, but you gotta get more to the left so the little thing can get. To, uh, so the thing can't connect to the damn truck so your, your pallet jack get on smooth and all that but I just got gas and uh, I gotta come back in the morning while well, I work in the morning anyway so I ain't gonna end this video just yet so before y'all bombard me with questions this is not my truck bro this is not my truck and my back in the box truck business uh no I'm just doing this part time for my boy Jay John. My boy Jay John said he need to drive, and I said I'll do it. I got a little easy schedule: Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday. Come on, man, you can't beat that. I, it doesn't interfere with my vending machine stuff. So I get done around seven, eight o'clock. The days that I that I drive. So yeah, <laughs> I'm here for a good time, not a long time. This is this is not my business, okay? But let me get this gas up out of here and head back to the yard. And I'll be right back. All right, man. So we back at the yard. Got the truck parked, man. About to go home. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Look at that motherfucker right there. Golly. Make sure you subscribe, man. But yeah. We back in it. Got it parked. Right back at it in about 12 hours, bruh. Yes, sir. Well, 24. I'm tripping. That's 24. Whatever. In the morning. But yeah. Funny story about this truck. So on my ride along, I drove it yesterday, and it's been about two years since I had my box truck. But the thing is, I had a 20 footer, and it didn't sit as high as this one does. You know what I'm saying? And when you ain't drove a truck, and you've been driving cars and vans, it, it it can get a little intimidating. You know what I'm saying? So this truck, y'all know the seats that be bouncing and stuff. So I told bro, I was thinking about it, but once I got once I got done, I told him like, hey man, I was thinking about telling this one gonna work out because I can't drive and I'm bouncing and stuff. And Dallas got some bad streets, so you are gonna feel every 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 crack, every bump, every you gonna feel everything. You know what I'm saying? But we got together though, we got together. So yeah, you can call me anything you want to, but <laughs> make sure you call me a grinding ass nigga. Make sure you call me a hustler. Cause come on, bro. Vending machines. Now this my wine YouTube channel. Truro, come on, bro. I'm all about a dollar. We trying to chill in our thirties. You know what I'm saying? But that's enough. Of all that. I'll be back in the morning, bro. Top of the morning, man. Right now it's about 1:45. Just got the truck all warmed up and stuff. And uh, it's time to head to the to the warehouse, man. And today we got a big boy route. We're gonna be driving today. I think we got we got five stops 170 miles I believe you know what I'm saying 
So yeah, we gotta we get it in today. We are getting it in. So I'm up on that. Tell y'all where I'm going real quick. We are going to We're going to Athens, Texas, Corsicana, Ennis, and Coffee. So those are uh I think the first stop is like an hour and two minutes. And then after that, it's like 30 minutes plus to be shy, be stopped. So I'm slated to be done by 7.30 a.m. It's currently 1.43. I'm about to head to the red house, get there a little early. Cause yesterday, I was showing up with that parking. But I got it now, I gotta go in a little angle. But yeah, after that, I'm gonna gas up, then I'm gonna show y'all my load, you know what I mean? And then we gonna get, we gonna get pushing. These are all little small country towns, so these post offices I'm gonna deliver to are gonna be some small post offices, you know what I'm saying? They're pretty, and they might, they not gonna be open either, so I gotta either leave it outside or I don't know. But we gonna see, it's gonna be a fun one, so y'all stick around, right? All right, man, we loaded up. We got an hour drive ahead of us, so we're going to Athens, Corsicana, Ennis. I was going to Kaufman, but they took Kaufman off, so let's go ahead and slide down this road, back. All right, man, we just knocked that hour out at our first stop. But I can't unload because it's a truck right here, bruh. I don't even know if you're in there. I don't know. I don't already do that, honestly. But he can move, so I can get up out of here. All right, we got that stop down. He was in the sleep, so he got here early to take a nap. I fuck with it. I fuck with it. But uh, on to the next stop, which is Corsicana. I think I got like four, five pallets there. So let's slide. Corsicana, five pallets. Then we got one more stop, and then we going to the crib. Yes, sir. Alright, last stop is Ennis, and that's where all these going to 25 minutes away. Last seven pallets, baby, then we going home. Bruh, the, the, the post office workers, they, they hate these trucks, bruh. Because look at all this. They got to scan all these packages and put them like in a bin and all that. They hate it. She was like, how many you got? I said seven. She said seven. Nah, you lying. I said, nah, I'm dead ass. I got seven pounds in this joint for you. <laughs> you know what I mean? But I'm going to unload and we can go home, back. All right, man, so we are back in the whip and they head home. Uh, today was a, it was cool. It was easy, it was easy. But uh, I really hope y'all enjoyed this content, this new content that I'm bringing to the channel. You know, it's all about evolving. You know, I don't want to keep doing the same stuff. And I don't want to bore y'all. And uh, that was part of the reason I agreed to do this. I wanted to, uh, you know, me and bro doing each other favors. I'm keeping, I'm helping keeping his truck running and I get to make some extra coins and, and bring new content. So, you know, it's a win-win for both of us. But uh, y'all yeah, let me know down below what y'all think of this content. I'm not going to record every time I go on the road unless I'm going like out of town or some shit. But that is Amazon Relay, you know. And for the questions I'm about to get, no, that's not my truck. It's not my truck. But I do drive it four days out the week now. And uh, yeah, I'm doing Amazon Relay. So for all my box truck drivers out there that do Amazon Relay, drop a yep in the comments, you know what I'm saying? But that's gonna be a wrap. I'm hot, I'm hungry, I'm tired. I'm about to go home and edit this video and get it up for y'all. So y'all watch these next two videos that's popping up. And if you like, if you like, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that like, share, subscribe. And follow me on my socials right there, man. Let's go crazy. And I'm out, bro. Yay!